Hello guys, I'm sorry for just popping into your LinkedIn feed. I'm actually on my way to see a customer but I couldn't help doing this little quick video to talk about social selling because I checked in my LinkedIn profile just before I thought I'd leave. And I'm not happy because right now it feels like I'm slowly but surely being transformed from being a consumer of great quality content on LinkedIn to just becoming a target of somebody else's clunky social selling effort. Now, don't get me wrong. I actually happen to think social selling is a fantastic thing. Because I think we all need new ideas. Seriously. We need to be exposed to things we may not know about or things we don't think we need to know about. Because I just happen to believe that there needs to be a pretty healthy balance between the input of ideas, now that's you picking up stuff, new stuff, and the output of ideas, and that's you producing things in your own line of work. Because no new innovation happens in isolation. I happen to believe that innovation happens when great ideas collide. Now, there are two things I'm looking for in great quality content as part of the social, uh, social selling effort. Number one, I will ask myself, will I learn something valuable if I read this piece of content or watch the video? And number two, is the content structured in a way that allows me to reuse it in my own line of work? Because I'm, I'm lazy. In other words, Will the content set off a spark in my head? And if it does, can I use the spark to light up a freaking bonfire? Now, for me, if those two criteria are met, I'm all good, keep the social selling messages coming. But for crying out loud, stop with the selling. Social selling is not about selling as such, it's about educating the market, not pitching products. It's about teaching your audience how to read, and then sell them books. Be smarter about how you want your audience to reuse the stuff you create and let your audience run with your ideas. If they get it, I mean, if they really understand what you're trying to do, they will come back to you again and again and again. So there you have it, my two cents on this. Now go out there and be smart about your social selling. I'm off to my customer.